Are you thinking of going on a short-term missions trip at home or abroad? First, ask yourself this fundamental question. Why? Why would you go? Why would God send you? And how would you know? Pray about it. Not to go for the wrong reasons, not to go to experience a different culture and have fun, not to go expecting just to have a great time and to visit different places and see different things, but to go to serve God's church with a servant's heart because that's the most important thing. If you really feel like you're prepared to um, do uh, an RP mission trip, that you are already involved in some type of mission work. Mission work can take place uh, anywhere. Uh, and most importantly, it needs to be taking place wherever you are right now. And so I would say to somebody that is thinking about doing a missions trip is um, ask yourself whether or not you are currently involved in mission work. First thing I would tell anyone that's considering going on a short-term mission trip is to stop and seriously pray about it. Are you going for the right reasons? You want to make sure that as you're going on a mission trip, you really have at the core of, of why you're going the desire to serve Jesus Christ and His church. Sure, you're going to get an opportunity to perhaps explore another culture or see new sites or uh, experience life in another, uh, speaking another language. Um, you're going to see and, and grow in your understanding of new customs, try new foods, drive on another side of the road perhaps. But at the, at the crux of why we send out these mission teams, it is to be a service to a church. It is to bring glory to Jesus Christ. And if we go for the reason to have a holiday, if we go to, to vacation over the summer, to escape the, the grind of work, uh, we're going to be sorely disappointed both in what we take away from the mission effort, but we'll also be sorely disappointed at what we're able to accomplish on that mission effort because we will have competing allegiances. And so if you prayerfully consider why you want to go on a mission trip, if you take time to talk with your pastor about your desire to go on that mission trip, seek godly counsel to encourage you. Um, see if they see in you that servant's heart and would encourage you to go and further develop your skills for ministry in Christ Church. If you get their commendations to go, I would encourage you to go on an RP missions trip because you'll be just the type of person that we're looking for to serve Christ gladly, to take this opportunity to see your Savior glorified in another culture, another community, to see the gospel go forth, and then to watch as God's Holy Spirit builds His church. When Jesus gave His disciples the Great Commission at the end of the Gospel of Matthew, He said, All authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. Go therefore and make disciples of all the nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all things that I have commanded you. So RP Missions works with established congregations and missionaries around the world to serve Christ and His Church while providing short-term aid to implement programs of host congregations. You are sent out to covenant communities in the U.S. and around the world to help them serve, proclaim, and disciple their communities. So pray about it. Pray about why you want to go on a short-term missions trip. And if you believe God is calling you to serve, proclaim, and disciple by helping establish churches in need of help at home or around the world, let us know you'd like to join us. Apply today.